Okay, so my first meal will be the oatmeal with a hard boiled egg, a glass of water, and it comes out to 340 calories. The egg is 60 and the oatmeal is 280. All right, I'm not the best cutter in the world, but there is the apple and I decided to have two pickles because they are pretty small. So the apple is 70 calories, each pickle is five calories, so that would be 10 calories. 70 plus 10 is 80, and then 80 plus the 340 is 420. Okay, so here it is, all finished and complete. So the calories go like this. Tuna, 70 calories, mayo is the 45, carrots, 35, wheat thins, 140. All this, and all this, which is a lot of food, came out to only 290 calories. So 420 plus the 290 is 710. Yum. And I am on my second glass of water for today. Okay, so meal number four is some crunchy peanut butter. I measured it and weighed it, so that is a serving. And then I'm having some celery with it. Make sure you clean your celery, <laughs> that's very important. And for calories, the peanut butter is 200 calories, the celery is 10, so that's 220 plus the 710 is 920. Okay, so here is my dinner. I'm probably gonna end up putting sriracha on this just for a little bit of spice because I do love spice and I have a serving of peas so I I chose to do two servings of the rice so that's 300 200 for the chicken 80 for the peas and 25 for the olives that came out to 605 which plus the 920 from earlier came out to 1525 with my dinner I am gonna have a Sprite Zero so the last thing I'm gonna have is this little chocolate ice cream container thing and it's only 100 calories. So all the calories I had today is 1625. I'm just gonna have one of these Bolt House Farms drinks. Um, a lot of people are like, Emily, it's so much sugar. It's all sugar from fruits. I know people are very, uh, Sugar from fruits is the same thing, etc., etc. But I'm to the point where I'm just like, I'd rather have sugar from fruits than sugar from a candy bar. So I'm gonna scan it on my Weight Watcher app. See how many points it is because I have no idea. The kind that I'm having is Multi V Goodness Cherry. Um, there is. Two apples in this, six and a half cherries, one fourth banana, 13 and a half cranberries, nine and a half berries, and 17 pom pomegranate, April things. So there is two servings in this. So yeah, it says a serving size is eight ounces, servings per container is two. So on the little servings thing on my app, I'm gonna put that I am having eight times two is 16 so 16 ounces which is gonna be 14 points so it's 14 points for this and I have a lot of points for the whole day so that leaves me with 70 points left so that is the first thing I'm eating so let me shake it up and try it on camera because I have never had this one before I don't think I don't remember but it just sounds really good And it is really good so I'm gonna drink that and then I also have my water I got this from TJ Maxx so that's the first thing I'm eating so the next thing I will be eating is this Lean Cuisine sesame chicken TV dinner this is 11 points their Weight Watchers is now calling it smart points so it's 11 smart points eating this will leave me with 59 more points Okay, so the TV dinner is done, and I'm also gonna have a serving, serving and a half, or two servings of some raw carrots, and carrots are zero points, so free food, yay! Okay, you guys, so I made a recipe. Yes, I'm using paper plates, so don't mind me. <laughs> but I made a recipe, it's just ground turkey, chickpeas, zucchini, 
and seasoning. I used garlic, pepper, some onion powder type stuff. For this whole amount is 35 points and that's gonna leave me with 24 more, more points. So that is a lot of fucking food right there. Excuse my language. Um, something I've noticed with, just for today, with how many points Weight Watchers has given me, I feel like I have to constantly eat, which for someone like me is not that difficult. But it makes me wonder, you know, should I be eating 84 points in one day? So, this is what I will be eating. Again, just chickpeas, ground turkey, and zucchini with some seasoning. Look how hot it is, you see the smoke. So, if you wanted to make this, um, I was thinking about adding some tomato sauce, but I kind of like my stuff not with sauce all the time, so. All right, you guys, so the next thing that I will be eating is some of this chicken breast lunch meat with some of this garlic and herb um, cream cheese. What I do with the cream cheese and the chicken is I put a little bit of cream cheese in the middle of each chicken slice and that's what they look like. I know it looks weird. I'm also gonna have some cherries. This actually tastes really good if you wanna have something that resembles a sandwich but you don't want actual bread. Um, you can always put the cream cheese, like lay it down flat and then just roll up the chicken so they look like roll ups, but that's just how I do it. So this is all seven points. So that means I have 17 points left. Probably as ridiculous as this sounds, I am hungry again. I've eaten so much today. This opens my eyes a lot to how much I eat in a day, but I still have points left. This is eight points. So by eating this, um, that will leave me with nine points left. This is a Healthy Choice Simply Steamers beef and broccoli. I've never had this kind before. Um, I don't know, it sounds good. Tender beef strips and broccoli with brown rice and a sesame soy sauce, so guess we'll see. All right, everyone, so that's it. That is all I ate. Um, I'm actually kind of shocked <laughs> that I'm ending the day with nine points. So it is past midnight, so it does say yesterday, but that is definitely from today. Um, it's like 1 a.m. right now, so, but yeah, nine points, I did it, yay! I log all my calories on my fitness pal. We have six ounces of chicken, broccoli, little uh, potato company, they're like little potatoes, and we use some butter on the potatoes because it says in the instructions to do so. So for this meal is 390 calories, and this is how it looks. Tons of delicious broccoli. I actually cooked this from scratch. Usually I do frozen, but this is fresh, so I'm very proud of myself. Got some chicken, which has pepper and some like chicken seasoning that I got from Walmart, and then the potatoes. So this is 390 calories for a lot of food. So it is about four hours later, and I'm gonna be showing you my next meal. I am having rotisserie chicken, and without the skin, obviously. And I'm having some quinoa and brown rice. It's super good. And this came out to 610 calories. So that means I am at 1,000 calories. And that's all I've ate today. So I want to show you guys what it looks like. A lot of my meals I do just like chill in bed. And like watch something on Netflix or something. But this is how it looks. The chicken's at the bottom. I tried to stir up some. But see right there. I watch uh, Netflix from my laptop. So I have been trying to eat slower and just be more mindful while I'm eating. I feel like that's really important. And I noticed that earlier for my first meal, I was doing it, I actually got really full towards the end. So that's awesome. So I'm having some Amy's pesto pasta. I'm having a pudding. And I'm having two veggie patties. They're like a spicy black bean. So I'm actually probably going to have a pudding later too. Because they're only 100 calories for this. I mean it is really small. I need a chocolate fix. So I figured that would be fine for me. 
and it's only 100 calories and my calories are at 1750 so if i add um that i'm having another one of those i have to sneeze <sighs> okay <laughs> Um, if I add them having another one of those, it'll come out to 1850. And if I decide to have another one, it'll be 1950. So I'm just putting that I'm gonna have two more way later. I noticed some people are gonna be like, oh my god, that's so much. But like these little things, like there's like two bites in there, three bites, like whatever. Okay, so this is what the pesto looks like. This is an Amy's vegetarian pesto, and they're super good. Love this so much tortellini and these are the veggie patties uh obviously no i'm not vegetarian i had tons of chicken today but i really like vegan foods and vegetarian foods they are super good and i am drinking water so things are going fine and dandy so i just wanted to end my vlog i'm ending my calories at 19 something so i am having two more puddings here in a little bit i just want to let you guys know so that's everything i ate for today